said no woman could ever get a crew of bad guys. Well, I didn't just get bad guys. I got two of the fucking worst. You call that a crew? A midget and a mudslide? <laughs> I'll give you one chance to tell the world Harley Quinn's crew ain't nothing to fuck with. Or what? I'll say it! Oh, I know you will. <laughs> Motivational speaker and self-proclaimed supervillain Maxi Zeus was found beaten this morning. Oh, 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 fuck, fuck. Mr. Zeus, how, how did this happen? Who did this terrible thing to you? All I can say is... Harley Quinn's crew ain't nothing to fuck with. Sounds like Harley Quinn, former girlfriend of the Joker, is striking out on her own. Holy fucking shit, Harls, you did it. I would not have seen that coming. It's been 30 long years since a female villain had a crew when the Queen of Fables tried to smash through that glass ceiling but was imprisoned in the U.S. tax code by the Justice League. Because they're bitches. But well, I'll be damned. All he's actually going for. One thing's for sure, the Joker's ex may soon become his biggest competitor. <laughs> this is Tony. Well, you know, congratulations. I mean, I know gold medals aren't a nuclear warhead, but, you know, you gotta start somewhere. Oh, no, I got a warhead. I traded the gold medals for it. Get out of town. Where is it? I'll use it to blackmail the city, just like I said I would. Hey, y'all, it's me again. This just in. We take you live to a high-speed chase on the abruptly renamed Harley Quinn Parkway. I'll be fucking damned. Totally worth it. Right?